Hi guys, how are you all doing? And welcome to the channel. Now, if you wanted to cook better at home, you've come to the right place. I'm Rick, the Backyard Chef. Cauliflower, one of the most underrated veggies. It doesn't have to be. With about 10 or 15 minutes preparation, you can turn the humble cauliflower into a superb dish with a creamy sauce topped with a bubbling cheese crust. Absolutely awesome. So today we are going to make cauliflower cheese. Let's show you how to make cauliflower cheese. With our cauliflower we want to remove the outer leaves. And then in a circular motion we need to cut round the stalk removing the florets. Now go all the way to the bottom of the stalk and remove the floret from the end. Trim up the florets to about equal size and then we want to put them in a pan of water. Add a pinch of salt and bring our water to the boil. Now we only want to boil for about 7 minutes. After 7 minutes we want to remove the cauliflower and drain it. Okay, we need to make a nice cheese sauce for this. So, 60 grams of butter in a pan and melt it. Add 60 grams of flour. Stir it through to cook out the rawness. Add a splash of milk. Keep stirring. We're building up a lump free sauce. Keep cooking out the rawness and then stir in another splash of milk. Then we need to change to a whisk just to make our sauce smooth. Add the remainder of our milk and stir through until we get this silky smooth sauce. Add a pinch of nutmeg, stir it through and add a good handful of cheese. Whichever cheese you like, I'm adding cheddar. And stir that into our sauce mixture. We should end up with a real gloopy cheese sauce. Okay then in our baking dish we want to put a little bit of cheese in the bottom. I always put it in the bottom, it sort of lines it out for when we put the cauliflower on. Then add our cauliflower. Add a pinch of salt and pepper to the cauliflower. And pour over the remainder of our cheese. And then just work our cheese into the cauliflower slightly so it only goes in a little bit dust over the top with a pinch of nutmeg and then we want to put our cauliflower mixture in a preheated oven at 180 degrees for 30 minutes or until it is golden brown and bubbling on top after 30 minutes take out let cool a little bit before serving and enjoy. Now guys, don't forget like and subscribe if you like what we're doing. And we'll catch you next time.